My name is Lindsay Karras, and I'm the Resident Services Coordinator at Sterling Meadows, which is a property of Mercy Housing Northwest. We house 51 families, and we have about 215 residents here, um, and it's for specified farm working families. And a lot of our families come from other countries, and the parents aren't necessarily educated um, in our system, and so navigating the school system is a little difficult for our families. Um, and again, we've had great strides with the Bellingham Public Schools in creating liaisons for those families. Um, but a lot of these kids are first generation students through our, our systems. So I think there are many ways to go around solving conflict in creative ways and I think me is really um, blessed. We're blessed in that area to have so many different opportunities to partner and collaborate. Um, we work really closely with the school district, um, <clears throat> with the police department, with the public library system, with Goodwill and all, you know, different banks. Um, we do programming here not only in education, but in community, health and wellness, financial literacy and housing stability. So we're able to do things like run a mobile clinic here with, in conjunction with CMAR, where our families are able to get their preventative care needs met at their housing complex once a month. Um, and that's just one example of all the partnerships. We, we really do have a plethora of, of great work that's being done in the community. And I feel like, especially here, if there's someone you want to partner with or something that you want to do, the answer is always yes. It just depends on how it's yes. When I started here 10 years ago, for many years we didn't have any students graduating from high school. Um, and that was for a myriad of reasons. Um, gang involvement was one of them, but also um, there was a lack of a migrant program. Um, so students who moved down to Mexico for a couple, year, or a couple months every year um, would lose their high school credit. And so the school district has really stepped up their support of our families and the students in school. And we met that need here with our programs. Um, and we have a really kind of fluid motion between home and school here. So we actually have access to our kids' grades and attendance and behavior. And what we're able to do with that is really see how kids are doing in school and, and support them in that. Um, and what we've seen is that our graduation rates have increased drastically. So this year, um, we celebrated our fifth year of 100% graduation rate, um, which is fantastic. So every single one of our kids in the last five years has graduated and we've sent 27 of them off to college. For me, it's been a huge joy to be able to see our kids and our youth cultivating their passion. And so really um, giving them the tools to explore what they want to be and what they want to do in the community and, and just reinforcing that as much as we can. Um, so my dream is, is that all of our kids get to find their passion.